Hello everyone, got the gamer skills here and welcome to the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. This is like a really popular game right now, so I decided to play it too. I played the Stanley Parable before on the channel, but I felt like it was good to come back to it. Make sure you smash like button, smash the subscribe button, and let's check out what this update's about. Okay, and again, the end is never the end, is never the end, is loading never, or nev. Ever the uh, okay, let's read this. Ever the end is never the end is never the end is loading nev. The end is never the end. Okay, so when will this game start? Hello? Shouldn't there be a narrator? Guys, I think the narrator's home sleeping. What we should do right now is, uh, exit, oh. This is the story of a man named Stanley. I remember this. Stanley worked for a company in a I'll big I'll let you guys see it, though. Where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427, and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul wounding, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Okay, Stanley. the Stanley Parable. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour, when he realized... Ooh, I think... Or what did I just do? Oh, I clicked. I shouldn't have clicked. Well, I'm in the game now, so let's start this. All of his co-workers were gone. What okay, so we go around. Nothing's here. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply kind of laggy. Out. Yeah, it's really laggy. I'm gonna do something. Okay, the mouse sensitivity seems okay. Video. Why say? Oh my God! Why sync's on? Turn that off. Quality. Let's turn that to medium. Oh, back. Resume. Oh yeah, that seems better. Less laggy. Oh, the sensitivity is really low. Sorry guys, but this might take a while. Well, I don't want to begin the game again. Okay, s let's turn it from 5. No, let's go to 7. I didn't mean to go to 8. Six, seven, eight. Oh, you know what? Fine, I'm gonna play on eight. Oh, that's better. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay, let's go this way. I don't really remember much about this game. Yet there was not, not a single lie. person here either. Tips for not getting fired. Talk less. Stanley Do unbelievably to go amazing office, work all over the time. Okay, let's an just get there. out of here. Broom closet. Can I open this? I can open this. Stanley stepped into the broom closet, nothing here. but there was nothing here. So he turned around and got back on track. Coming to I the staircase, to Stanley here. walked upstairs to his red boss's door down office. There? I didn't see. This is a nice office, by the way. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this. What dark secret was being held from him? What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from early? him. And so the boss had Will assigned it anything? an extra secret pin number, 2845. But of course, 
Stanley couldn't possibly have known this. Yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stanley happened to input the correct code by sheer luck. Amazing. He stepped into the newly opened okay, passageway. Okay, oh, it's darker. I don't remember the graphics being this good. Press the down button. Oh my, okay. This looks horrible. This elevator actually looks disgusting. Anyways, loading again, loading, except it doesn't say what it said before. Now it says loading, loading, lo Descending deeper into the building, okay. Stanley better not turn. he felt a bit peculiar. This it was narrator a better not turn on me. Chest, as he I mean, in the game, he doesn't actually himself, turn on you. To question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now? Which way when do I stand? Years, it had never occurred to him. This question would not go unanswered for long. Okay, let's go. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. So dark. I don't like how dark they made the game. My brightness is all the way up. And that's all I'm saying. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What oh horrible my God, secret that would, did this place hold? Like Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the strength to find out? Okay. I'm heading... I'm heading, heading, heading up. Now the monitors jumped to life. Their true nature revealed. Employee. Each bore the number of so an employee in the building. Some of the employees were fired. The lives Literally of so fired. many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored I guess they place, um, tried to find this secret facility and they got fired. I, I'm guessing that's what happened. This mind control facility, it was too horrible to believe. Yeah, it I pressed couldn't the be elevator true. button, no elevator. Had Stanley there. really been under someone's oh, control the all elevator. this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his Let emotions me walk had been onto the elevator, to please. accept it blindly? I have been known as, a, as an employee of this place. Oh, I'm stuck. I can't get onto the elevator. Wait, I can't get onto the elevator. Oh, that's no. perfect. He refused to couldn't believe get it. Onto the he elevator. couldn't accept it. His own life in someone else's control. Where am I going? Never. It was unthinkable. Into darkness. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? But here was the proof. The heart of Ooh. the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy or Facility sad power. or content. Walking. Eating, working, all of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would oh, never should again I turn it exert off? its terrible should power I turn over it another off? human life. Should I turn for it he off? Should would I dismantle the controls once no and for there. all. Should I just turn it off? Did I win? Did I lose? What happened? Is anything going to happen? Blackness and a rising chill of uncertainty. Was it over? There's just darkness. Yes. He had won. He had defeated the machine. Unshackled himself from someone else's command. Freedom was mere moments away. Ooh. And yet, even as the immense Something door slowly happening. opened, Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. Where Sliding had his co-workers gone? How had he been freed from the machine's grasp? That looks kind of nice, what actually. Other I want to go there. What other building hold? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, he realized Can I jump through the television him, screen it was not and go and make this a reality, or am I just going to hit the glass and 
Perhaps his goal had not been to understand. Dumb and to then everyone's go. gonna laugh at me. No longer would anyone Hopefully tell that doesn't go, happen. What to do or Hopefully. How to Whatever life I'm gonna jump! It will be I can't jump. Spacebar does nothing. Ooh, it was actually it looks really nice. Is this like a park? Stanley stepped or there's a house the open door. Whose house is this? Am I just walking into someone else's backyard? Stanley felt the cool breeze upon his skin. The feeling of Oh, they made this look really good. The immense possibility of the new path before him. This was exactly the way <coughs> right now. Well, look at the clouds. This looks like a really nice place. And Stanley was happy. Oh, so did I win? I wasn't actually told. I'm sorry, narrator. Did I win or did I lose? Oh, I guess I will never know. Because that apparently was the end. But it also was never the But it also was not the end. Because the end is never the end. If that even makes sense. All right, guys. I'm. I did. I'm gonna end it there. There are gonna be multiple parts to this game. So if you want to see me come back to this game, make sure you some. Let me know down below and smash like button, smash the subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next episode.